Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tay Chi Chu and I don't know what I'm doing. I will never know what I'm doing and that's what I'm using as an intro. Uh, welcome back to the 31 days of October Spooktacular. Um, today we are doing something- now listen. I know these aren't the spookiest things in the world. It's kind of like an unboxing slash review of a shop. Now listen, 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 listen. Mothman, right? The relation to this is going to be Mothman. <laughs> Because these these things aren't particularly spooky, but I thought that they were super, super cute. And I wanted to get them. And October was coming up. And I wanted to do the 31 days of spooktacular spookiness. So I so the connection to this is Mothman is spooky. A moth is within the Halloween season. And that's where I'm getting this. Anyway, we are doing a uh Rev uh, store review of the store called, I believe it's Lumichi. I'm not sure how it's pronounced. Lumi Lumichi? Um, I apologize if I say it wrong. I found this on Twitter and I fell in love with these and apparently they're going to be making bats and bats are like my freaking favorite thing of Halloween. So I'm really excited. I want to do more and these are so freaking cute and I can't wait to share it with you. It's not Pokemon, oddly enough. But look at, I'm gonna show you guys the first one that I got. This is what is called a mouse moth. Look at this cutie patootie. This is the pink lemonade mouse moth. As you can see, it has a little apron. You can take off the apron, I'm not going to. It has a little tie in the back. Golly, my lighting. It has a little tie in the back. You can see, look at, she's got toe beans. Ah! Very, very, very soft plush. Uh, clearly the arms are the wings slash, you know, it doesn't have like physical hands. But I just want to talk about the attention to detail within this plush. Not only within the design of its clothing, but the eyes, the blush, the mouth, the little eyebrow, and the little moth antennas. Also, if you go like this, you can see the detail behind the ears. So this is like a mix between a moss and a mouth, aka mouse moth. And I want to show you guys what it came in when I first got it. It came in this lovely little bag. I got two of them. Not, it, you'll see. But it comes with a little bit of confetti. And it came with the card I showed you before that said Lumichi. And it says thank you on here. Sorry, my lighting is bad. And I think that it's so freaking cute. I, like I said, I can't wait to get more of these. Here is a birth certificate it also comes with. As you can see, very, very cute. You can name it yourself. I've officially adopted it. It has a little lemonade stand. I'm assuming what happened here is that there was an artist that wanted to make um, their designs into plushes. And honestly, I don't blame them. I'm taking up sewing and plush making because, God forbid, I, I want so many plushies. And I'm just going to start making them myself. It's official. Um, that's not going to be for a while, though. But yeah, this is... I'm going to compare it to the size of my head because that's what I always do with plushes. Pretty big plush. I believe it retailed for about $35.99, if I'm not mistaken. You'll have to check on their website. They're on Twitter. I'm following them. I retweet a lot of their stuff a lot of the time. They're at Lumichi on shop on uh, Twitter. Look at... Oh, so cute. I love her. So, yeah. This is my little... My pink lemonade mouse moth. I'm sorry about the lighting. You're just... You're so bright, my dear. You're so bright. But, um, I haven't really named her yet, but I think that she's adorable, and I love her so, so much. Now, for her sister. Now she did come with a name and there are, there is a set of two that you can buy with these. They also sell pins, but I'm not very interested in pins. The only pins that I have are on my work um, name tag and I don't really, you know, it's complicated. But look at this little gem. This is Primrose, which I also love the name of. Look at her wings. Uh, the wings on this are a little different from the, uh, these ones, these ones are fuzzier. But it, I, it doesn't mean I hate the fabric. This is from the Moth Moth collection. There's Primrose, and I believe that there's Luna. Luna, in contrast, is um, green, and I believe pink. It's either green and white, green, pink, one of those. But look at the lighting. As you can see, you can see the little details, just like on the pink mouse moth. It's, it's very big as well. You can see the little toe beans, and this one is an actual moth. It's not a mix between a mouse and a moth. It's a mouse. It's a moth moth, and I just think it's so freaking cute. They also have tags on them, as you can see. The mouse moth moth. This one's Luna, but I really wanted Primrose. I wanted to see if I liked the plush first, and before I got more of them, because that's just a, I, I'm not trying to overspend anymore. Um, 
But yeah, look at her. She's so pretty. Oh my god, I love her. Look at her. Look at both of them. Like, I feel like my pink lemonade moss mouth is like, because it was made, um, first, I believe. I be think that it's like the older sister to Primrose. <laughs> I love the little dot, um, where my pinky's pointing eyebrows. The details in these plushes are insane, and they're so freaking cute. As you can see, there is more, um, of the um, adoption forms on here. I thought it's so cute. I will be getting Prim, or I will be getting Luna eventually. I just want to probably do a bigger order because of shipping and stuff like that. Sorry, I'm getting warm. But yeah, look at these. I want to rate these 10 out of 10. I'm trying to get more into little shops. I'm also trying to get into sewing myself. So maybe, you know, in the future, but look at these. But again, th there's no, they're spooky. Mothman. Ah, ah. But the only thing that's spooky is how cute they are. Look at these. Look at these guys. So cute. I love the eyes. I love everything about them. But yeah, um, that's it for today's video. What did you guys think of these? Are you guys going to check them out on Twitter? Let me know down below. Um, and thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Okay, bye.